Hey babes, what's up? We are back with another video and if you are new on my channel, my name is Steffi Glam. I would love for you to stay with me so don't forget to subscribe down below and ring the little bell so you don't miss any of my daily uploads. So guys, today we have, okay, the hat, hat, hat of the hatters going on right now and when i mean hat i'm talking about this baby right here this is the tiny marvels from cindy grace okay collaborating with mel thompson and if you don't know who mel thompson is i'm gonna put a little beautiful picture right here but she is the shit out here on youtube guys she literally creates some beautiful 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 makeup looks that I'd be like, oh my gosh, really, Mel? All right, but she is so talented, so sweet, so smart, so everything. And I am so happy that she came out and did a collaboration with Cindy Grace because I am a big, big fan of Cindy Grace. I have, I must have like five of her palettes and some of her pops and guys they are stunning okay i'm always always talking about that okay because i just think that they are they do need a little bit more hype because cindy grace is just a beautiful brand okay that i said it before in my videos and i'm just gonna say it again okay cindy grace have nothing nothing to hate on natasha denona on pomegranate on none of those big brands none okay so guys let me show you the baby okay and this is the palette guys look at those beautiful beautiful i'm sorry shades okay like come on is your mouth open do you want this palette do you i know you do girl i know you do <laughs> so i'm joking listen to me beautiful stunning shades okay and now besides the shades guys the formulation of this baby's right here is just out of the word okay um i heard some people before saying that they are known for the mattes no guys they are known for the like metallics okay this is not shimmer shades this is like some metallic formulation that you literally swatch these babies and you are going to be like well damn really it's just some crazy metallic formula that it's good you're gonna see it okay you are going to see that pop of metallic shade for sure okay and then besides that look at this look at this packaging okay i like that the packaging the box is the same as the um, actual partly because do you know how many times i actually bought a product before and then i like the box but i don't keep my products on the box there's some people that they do mine i don't keep it on the box because it is more space you know the box with the box is actually the product is just thicker so i have to take it out of the box because with all the makeup that i have I can't afford for me to have space for boxes so it's like sometimes I want the boxes so much and I'm like damn I really don't want to throw the box away so you know at this point I won't mind about not keeping the box because I have the same packaging on the palette and that is super super cute and look at this you know like the whole little I'm not a fan of box. I hate box, okay? I don't like anything box. No, 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 no. Like, I can't even see a little whatever because I would just take off running, okay? Oh it's Look at this box and these worms and these butterflies and this lady box and everything else. Like, it just looks so cute. So cute. And then she killed it with the green and purple, okay? And I like it, okay? I think it's so unique. I think you killed the male and I gotta give it to you. I gotta give it to you because you're killing the game. But alright babes, if you want to see how I created this makeup look and I'm gonna be doing two other makeup looks using this baby, keep on watching. Mwah. Okay babes, so to make this look with this baby right here, it is a super simple look. We are going to be using almost all of the colors, okay? Yes, look at that okay and let's start it is a 
super simple simple look okay so first i'm gonna be grabbing my blending brush and i'm gonna go into the color spider okay it is this brown right here okay and i'm gonna place this brown all over my outer v this is a really brown color okay and whatever is left on my brush i'm bringing into my um crease okay the black i'm grabbing a little bit more and i'm only gonna place it right here on my outer v and i'm gonna leave it right there okay so now guys really like this look we gonna be working with our pencil brush so grab one little grab whatever little brush you have like precise tiny because for this look guys you cannot like fuck up okay you need to be you need a brush small and you cannot mess up and you know put one color on top of the other one which because you're working with so many colors that it leans for you to kind of like put one shade on top of the other one and we don't want that okay so first guys we are gonna start with fire but okay right here okay and with my little pencil brush i'm gonna grab a little bit and i'm placing this green right here okay right on top of my lashes in the inner corner of my only in the little piece just like that okay and we're gonna leave it right there so that's how it looks uh, dry now we are gonna wet our little brush and we're gonna go back into fire buds and we're gonna place a little tiny more wet okay i'm cleaning my brush in between shades so now we're gonna go with mantis it is the matte green right here okay with the same pencil brush i'm gonna grab a little bit and i'm gonna place this color right on top of this uh shimmery green Okay, just like that. Okay, I'm grabbing a little more and I'm tapping this mat because I need a punch of color there. Okay, so now guys, we are gonna go into Miro Miado Walk. <laughs> it is this pinky shade right here. Oh, I love that shade. I love all of the shades in this palette. And I'm going to grab a little bit. And I'm going to start placing this color in my tear duct all the way on top of the green. Okay? Into like half of my crease. So starting right here. We are going to go up, up, up. Watch out and don't go on top of the green. Okay? Like literally go slow, take your time. Perfect. So now we're gonna go into BB. It is the golden shade in the palette. Okay. And I'm gonna place that shade right here on top of the um, on top of the crease in this little space. Okay. place a little bit right here leave the pink where it is perfect so now we're gonna go into GOV this beautiful purple right here okay and I'm gonna place this purple in right here on top of my lower lash okay right here on top of my lower lash between the shimmery green and the shimmer that's what we're gonna end it right there perfect guys so what we are going to do right here that we're almost done we are gonna grab scrap it is this baby right here beautiful it's a beautiful color it got like it's like a rusty kind of green bluish 
So we're gonna grab that shade and we're gonna place this shade right here on all of my outer V, okay? Just like that. But for this, I'm gonna be grabbing my blending brush and I'm gonna grab a little bit of spider, which is a darker brown, and a little bit of scrap, which it will be these two shades right here, okay? And I'm gonna mix them. I'm gonna grab a little bit of the brown and a little bit of scrap and I'm gonna place this shade right here on my outer V, okay? And then now whatever's left on my brush, really gentle and really soft, guys. I'm literally gonna go right here at the bottom of my brow bone, right on top of this pinky, and just try to softly, softly, and super gentle, I'm just trying to blend this out, okay? And then now for my lower lash, I'm gonna grab a little bit of Mantis. It is the green, okay? And I'm gonna grab this green and just drag it all along my lower lash. All along my lower lash. Now, babes, I'm gonna use my Marc Jacob. My, what color is this? Whirlpool, okay? It is this green liner. And I'm gonna use this baby for my waterline. Perfect, babes. So I'm gonna just place a little bit of mascara and then we'll be back for the second look. Mwah. Okay, babes, so first we're gonna be grabbing walking stick okay this shade i'm sorry right here okay and that's gonna be your transition color we are gonna place the starter on the outer v okay all the way in or crease okay so now babes we are gonna be grabbing a little bit of mantis it is this beautiful green okay and we are gonna place this on our crease right here kind of like right on top of the one that we just placed i want to keep it a little bit more of like greenish okay with a little bit more of the bottom i'm not bringing this green so much like all the way up okay okay so now babes we are gonna be grabbing my packing brush and i'm still working with the mantis shade and what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna pack 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 that color all over my lid okay i'm using it as a base so i'm packing 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 this is gonna be a green look. And I'm packing that green, okay, just like that. So when I place the shimmery greens on top of this green, obviously they're gonna pop more. But do you see how beautiful the green is just by itself? I will literally place a um, little, like on my lower lash, okay? I will just place some of this Pyther Shea, okay, on my lower lash and place some mascara and that's a look okay this is a look so now you know that's another look <laughs> okay so now with my packing brush guys i'm going to be wetting it i just it's a habit okay not because you need to wet it with this metallics you don't need to wet it i'm gonna be grabbing fire butts okay this shimmery green right there and i'm gonna place that uh, on my eye but starting from my inner corner only halfway of my leg okay perfect right on top of this green perfect babes and i'm gonna leave it right there okay do you see that okay so now with my other side of the brush, I'm gonna wet my uh, brush again, okay? And I wanna try a little bit of this color Scrap, okay? This one right here, 
on top. It looks stunning. Okay. I'm going to grab some of that. It's like a bluish kind of green. And I'm going to place that color right here on the center of my leg. Okay. Just like that. nice okay so now guys I'm gonna go back with a uh, fire butt the shimmery green okay right there in the middle I'm gonna wet my brush again and I'm gonna place some of this shade right here on the third of my outer V okay and yeah, and I'm gonna go in with Mantis. It is that green and really, really soft. We are gonna blend all the shimmers right here on top. So now I'm gonna go back with Scrap. Okay. And I'm gonna be using my blending brush to grab this metallic now. I'm gonna just place a little bit right here on my other bead. There. So now for my brow bone, I'm gonna use this color Web, okay? It's a really like light champagne kind of color and I'm gonna be placing that shade right here on my brow bone okay so now for the bottom lash let's use purple why not let's go with you B okay this one right here and let's just place that purple in my whole entire lower lash I leave it right there and for my inner corner what can we do for my inner corner I'm gonna go back with fire butts this shade right here uh, I'm sorry this one right here fire butts okay and I'm gonna place that shade on my inner corner it is the lighter green so now for this eye we're gonna do a look that is gonna be all matte okay I already used shimmer for this look shimmer for the other look and I just want mattes right now okay so for this look we're gonna use boogaboo okay it's this purpley shade right here okay it's like a plum color and that's gonna be my transition color okay i'm gonna start right here on my outer v and i'm gonna bring whatever is left into my crease that's what i want so now i'm going to use spider okay it is the dippers the darker is brown and I'm only gonna place this color on my outer V okay so only a little bit right here on my outer V okay so now I'm gonna be going into I'm gonna be using my jumbo blender brush because I'm gonna be packing a punch of sh this shade and I'm gonna go into Geo V okay it is this purple right here so what i'm gonna do guys is i'm gonna pack the shade and place it on my whole entire lid okay i want a purple look but i'm gonna change brushes guys i'm going back with my packing brush we just keep going right here see and then look how beautiful it looks perfect I'm gonna grab a little bit more and pack, 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 pack. I'm not doing any blending, okay? Just leave it right there, guys. I'm gonna go back with Spider, the darkest uh, brown, and place a little bit more on my outer V. Okay, just like that. Perfect. Blend the edges together one another okay 
And then now I'm gonna grab the shade uh, Love Bug. It is this light, okay, this other purple right here, Love Bug with the tip of my blending brush. And I'm gonna, with slow circular motions, I'm gonna blend right here. So with my um, inner corner brush, I'm gonna go back into Jules V. That purple that we have on our lip in the same shade it's going to be on my inner corner. I'm gonna go back with Boogaboo, okay? This purple right there with my flat definer brush and I'm gonna place this color in my whole entire um, lower lash. I'm going to leave it right here. Let me put a little bit of mascara and I'll be back, babe. Okay guys, so we are done with these three looks. I got two right here and then the one that I did for the intro, okay? And for this eye, I apply a little bit of my more Jacob, mm, what is it? Fine Wine Liner, okay? It is like this plump liner. I apply a little bit of my waterline and I am set to go. So this, um, I guys, I work with the greens. It is a really metallic eye look, and for this eye, it's just all matte. Okay, and again, guys, you could do the same exact thing that I did for this eye. Okay, you could do with the green. Okay, with the green, and all the other, and this color peachy. Really, with all the mattes. Okay, this palette is just so easy to use that it's incredible so the same thing that i did for this eye you saw me the only thing that i did i applied my transition color and then after that i picked the shade that i wanted for my lid with a packing brush pack 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 and then don't forget don't apply no shimmer on the inner corner of your lid i mean it is preferent but when i'm doing an all matte look it's literally all matte and that's what i like about it no shimmer no nothing okay so babes this partly this partly i gotta give it to it again this partly is just beautiful oh my god i love it so much and, you know it's crazy it's crazy it's totally fucking crazy because when you have a partly normally there is some shades that you don't even touch okay there is some shades that you really don't even touch and right here you could just bro listen a smoky eye with these two shades right here you could perfectly create okay and those greens and then you could also do another look with the gold just place that gold all in your freaking lid and you are set to go okay same thing with those pinky and i love it i love it i love it i love it and i think i don't have anything else to say about this baby guys um i do have a giveaway coming and this baby's already sold out it is available for pre-sale so if you want to go get yours but i do have a giveaway coming and this baby right here okay it's on the giveaway so i am doing a video with all the info and all this and that okay so stay tuned but all right babes i hope you like the looks that i created with this baby and i hope you want to recreate i hope you want to stay with me so don't forget to subscribe down below and ring the little bell so you don't miss any of my daily uploads Mwah! bye babes